be. Ravenclaw. Oh, yes. Just and loyal. True. Yes. Clearly. Hufflepuff. Hufflepuff? No. We're going to do it again. Now we are ready. Okay, so it's Halloween and I have on my, look at my Mickey Halloween sweatshirt, my bat socks, and my candles, and we are headed to Salem, Mass for Halloween. Now, if that's something you want to see, then just keep watching. Okay, yup, we're crazy. We went to Salem on Halloween, but it is filled with history. And where else should you be on Halloween? I mean, these historic buildings are everything. And they're everything and even more on Halloween. It's all blocked off. So, yup, block parties. And just so much fun. Everybody's dressed up. But the best part, why everyone goes to Salem, I feel like, is to see this. Yes, the Hocus Pocus house. There it is, live and in person. So much fun to see. It was such a beautiful warm day. Then we went off to the Ropes Mansion and we just happened to run into a wedding. Wait till you see. We walked through to the back to the beautiful gardens, which still looked amazing, better than mine even. And all of a sudden we see, well, like Freddy Krueger. Oh my God. And that witch, we were like, what are they doing here? And what, look at, look at the witch. He married the couple. These guys are in the wedding. Yes. How funny is that? Yep, there's the groom with the witch who marries them. And walking down the aisle <laughs> with the kitty. And here comes the bride with the dog and Freddy Krueger. Oh, too funny. We love that we had run into that. It was such a treat to see um, on Halloween. And I couldn't get over the witch who is marrying them. So much fun. Such a vibe for Halloween. And yes, look at their dahlias are still up. I cut mine all back and took them inside. But I just love the historic building. See? Just such a Halloween vibe. And then we hopped over to... This is like the first church in New England. It is so beautiful. And so pretty to see in person. It was a ton of fun. I couldn't believe we went there on Halloween. And then, of course, we had to go see the famous witch house. So actually, it was a judge who lived here. It was the judge who hung the witches back in the day. Um tons of people the weather was gorgeous but yeah there on Halloween Michael I and Anthony went so much fun oh there we are you walk around there's all kinds of really cool Halloween stores um, witchcraft stores the, she was having her fortune told oh you can't really see it so cool to see so we decided to walk into this store it was like a witchcraft store and they had all kinds of like handmade soaps and bath salts and actual voodoo dolls of which Michael walked away with a voodoo doll. I don't know whose side he's on, but um, yeah, look at lust potion bath salts. So much fun. 
We didn't get any bath salts. We got the voodoo doll and some handmade soap that's supposed to bring you money when you use it. I'll let you know. <laughs> this was a witch's altar of which you can write a note to a passed on loved one. So that I did to my dad. Wrote a note and tossed it on the altar. And then, look, here's the soap. Lucky soap. What else was there? I think there was happy, there was money, there was love. Um, just really fun. Ooh, Wicked Witch soap. And then I was walking along and I came across a Ouija board. And I'm like, hmm, I don't know. Ouija board in Sa I probably shouldn't be playing with this on Halloween in Salem. So I'm like, nope, put that away. We went out, we walked around, there's all kinds of people walking around in costumes. This guy was juggling, he was a comedian, so much fun for the kids to see. The crowds loved him. I love seeing all the people dressed up. They are unbelievable dressed up. Oh, and here again, Hocus Pocus, the famous city hall scene. People just flock to see this Hocus Pocus stuff here. We were starving. We went to the Hotel Salem. They have a rooftop bar. And look, perfect day. It can either snow in New England or it can be 60 and beautiful. We got the beautiful day. The views were so pretty. Um, wraparound views of Salem on Halloween. There's not much you, you can ask for. Michael loved it. And we had a couple of cocktails. And just some appetizers, some nachos, some quesadillas. Again, this was all about the gorgeous view. Truly a beautiful day in Salem, Mass. Um, we were thinking it was time to wrap up and start heading home because, look, the crowd really turns as the night goes on. And we had such a great time in Salem, but we did decide, oh, Beetlejuice, that we should probably pack it in. Look at these guys and go home. Thanks for watching. I hope you subscribe. <laughs>